Hey y'all, it's me again, Valerie. Welcome back to my yard room. Yay! Okay. Um, before we get started, I would like to invite anybody who has not already to hit that word subscribe. When you do, give the videos a thumbs up. Share them if you can, and leave me a comment. All right. I am not feeling the best. I, I think that winter bug is hitting me. It's hard to breathe. I'm getting dizzy when I stand. Um, don't know. I mean, I'm not running a fever. I'm I'm not coughing. Um, I think it's all up here, like sinuses and stuff. Oh, <laughs> that's the worst part about this time of year: getting sick. All right. That ain't what y'all here for. Uh, first off, I would like to apologize that I have not been around. That I have not been putting up videos. Um, it's It's been chaos in our life. Um, the, the truck is doing better, but... Still needs work. Um, it's been in and out of the garage for a couple months. Um, but it, it's doing better. Um, my dad went uh, yesterday and got his stitches out from getting his pacemaker put in. Um, so far, so good on that. It's, it's doing good. Um, from what I understand, it's just the pacemaker, not the pacemaker with the fibrillator. And they seem to work better than the fibrillators. The, the fibrillators, they, yeah, you, you have a lot of problems when you get one of those. Lots. Um, my cousin T.T., her husband, um, he got a pacemaker with a fibrillator and he's constantly having to go to the hospital and have stuff done and yeah, all kinds of stuff. But so far, my dad is doing really good with his. Okay. Um, ah. The last video that I put up I meant to tell y'all this, and it, it totally slipped my mind. See, when I put up a video, I, I do not jot down notes of what I'm going to say and this, that, and the other. No. I just turn the camera on and I talk and show what I have to show or face the other way and right here is my desk and I just do the tutorial whatever nothing is scripted is what I'm saying so I do forget things um but the thing that I forgot in my last video was you know the Val's Picks blanket that I've been doing? Sorry, I got an itch. <laughs> like I said, nothing's scripted. You never know. Um, the Val's Picks blanket that I've been that I was doing. Um, everybody who's watched the videos knows that that blanket was for my husband. It was in some of his favorite colors. His absolute favorite color is spring green. 
Well, the yarn that I picked didn't have a spring green, but they had a leaf green. So that was my base color. Well, my husband has graciously decided that he wants to donate his Val's Picks blanket. Um, anybody who knows, knows that I've been rapidly putting out, um, lap gans for the elderly at the, the nursing home. Okay. Well, at maximum capacity, this nursing home can only hold 35 residents. Well, they are at maximum capacity right now. So, me and the group of people that are helping with this have 35 lap gans to make. As of right now, we are at 29, counting the Val's Picks blanket that my husband has graciously decided to donate to this cause. And I have no problems with that whatsoever. I think it's wonderful. So we have 29 lap gans already made. We have two weeks from today to complete another six. Um, my daughter is still working on the one that, that she's been making. And um, the lady from my husband's job, uh, Dorothy, I said that she was going to be giving another lap gan today. Okay. So if those two are done, that'll be two of that six. So that leaves four more. Well, I am currently working on two. My mom is currently working on one. So that would leave one more. I think we got this. I seriously think we can get it done. Okay. Oh. All right. Um. I think that's all the news that I had to to share. Actually, I am currently working on three. I forgot about that one. Yeah. Okay, so. Y'all ready to see the temperature blanket for the no month of November? And it was um, five Wednesdays in November. I think. I ain't got my glasses on. I'll put them on. All right. Um, oh, it's really getting big. So I have really got it folded up. I've got the, the part that I'm working on. I have it folded into four sections. Okay. And then I have it folded multiple times <laughs> on the sides. Okay. It's, it's a queen size comforter. So it's very large. <laughs> 
All right, let me see if I can get this held up to where y'all can see it. There we go. Okay. And we're starting right here with this light blue. Okay. November the 1st was the first Wednesday in November. Ironic. Um, <laughs> all right. The high for that day was 48 degrees right here and in that spectrum i chose the color uh red heart super saver in the color blue okay next on the list was this one right here this darker blue and uh the low on November the 1st was 23 degrees. And for that spectrum, I chose the color uh, Big Twist Value in the color Varsity Blue. All right, next on the list is this yellow, which is the only, uh, only the second time that I have ever used this yellow in this blanket. <laughs> oh, okay. And that was on November the 8th. And the high that day was 74 degrees. And this yellow is Red Heart Super Saver in bright yellow. All right. Now, the low for that day was right here, this blue, which, okay. Anyway, it's, uh, the low was 51 degrees. And the color is Red Heart Super Saver in the color blue. All right, on to this green, which is November the 15th. The high that day was 61 degrees. And this is a uh, big twist value in the color light green. And the low that day right here was 40 degrees. And that's big twist value in the color Varsity Blue. There's a lot of Varsity Blue in this blanket. Okay, back over here, which was November the 22nd. The high that day was 59 degrees. And the color is Big Twist Value, light green. And back to this one, which the low that day was 44 degrees. And this color is Big Twist Value, Varsity Blue. All right, one more, because the, yeah, one more day. Back to this blue, which is November the 29th. The, temp the high that day was 49 degrees. And the color is Red Heart Super Saver in the color blue. All right, last one. Uh, the low on November the 29th was 24 degrees, and the color is Big Twist Value, Varsity Blue. And I've already got my temps wrote down for today, and after today, that only leaves... The 13th, the 20th, and the 27th for December. Because today is December the 6th. So there's only three more weeks after today for that blanket, and it'll be done. And when it is, that means that I would have done... Three 
let's see. Two queen size blankets, a twin size blanket, and so far, 18, seven, 17 lapgans just this year. Whoa, I've been busy. <laughs> Not to mention all the, uh, the the stitch tutorials that I've done this year. Um, let's see. I also, I think, made a cardigan this year. A project bag. All kinds of stuff. Good gracious. I've been busy this year. Well, the first is right around the corner. And, uh, the, the, well, the first of the year is right around the corner. Um, ooh, me and my husband, we have an anniversary coming up. Quick. Um, we got married on December the 31st. Yeah. Uh, we were trying to pick a date. And just everything kept happening and this, that, and the other. And uh, we were going to get married on Halloween because that's like one of our favorite holidays. That's why he always takes a week off during Halloween. It's, it's one of our favorite times of the year. Um, but, uh, something happened and we couldn't, and we just kept on and kept on and kept on pushing it back and pushing it back. And finally, my husband looked at me and he said, what about December the 31st? And I said, what? He said, well, that way we can start the new year with our new life as husband and wife. And I thought, that's so romantic. And I just melted. I was like, oh. <laughs> so, yeah, we have an anniversary coming up December the 31st. Most of the time, we don't do anything, like, really special. We might go out to eat. But it's usually not a real fancy restaurant. Because I'm not a fancy kind of person. Um, anyway. Oh, Christmas is right around the corner. I don't know how videos are going to go, because like I said, I'm, uh, I'm not feeling the best. I'm, I'm getting like really hot and dizzy and everything's spinning in my head and all this is like stopped up and yeah. So I don't know how videos are going to go. I do apologize. I, I don't mean to leave y'all hanging, but if I put up a video, great. If I don't, I apologize. I do have a lot going on. And I would like to apologize ahead of time if by chance I don't. Okay. Okay. Um, I guess that's going to be all for today. I, I was going to do a, a Bible verse, but I just, I can't this time. I, I will next time. Um, I'm, if I don't put up a video all week, I will be on here on Wednesdays, 
to show y'all at least the lap gans that I've made, what's been going on. Um, I'm, I'm going to try to keep in touch with y'all, okay? Um, anyway. Um, I'm not going to hold y'all any longer. Um, I, I truly do love each and every single one of y'all to pieces. And do something nice for somebody. Even if it's just a smile. A smile can turn somebody from a bad mood into a good mood. And carry them all the way through their day in a good mood. And they might smile at somebody else. And, you know, like a yawn, a chain reaction kind of thing. So, you'd be surprised what a smile can do to somebody. Um, so, I guess I will meet y'all back here in the next one. For another grand adventure. Right here. In Val's Yarn Room. <laughs> I got my little sign right there that says Val's Yarn Room. <laughs> <laughs> it lights up, but when I light it up, it's so bright, you can't see the words on the video. All you see is a big white glow. <laughs> Need to find a way if I can dim it. <laughs> um... <sighs> yep. That's going to be all. All right. Get your crochet on. I'm going to. Bye, y'all. <laughs>